A lot. Uniforms everywhere. You see Sean? No. I don't think so. Damn it. Where's Trelawney? Who knows? Just keep your eyes open. I am. Hey. Hey. <clears throat> Where is that little Irish pest? I'm not quite sure. Trelawney's off trying to find out. Anyone been in the black water see how things lie? Place is crawling with Pinkertons, bounty hunters, and ah, pictures of Dutch and Hosea. Uh, well, we got a lot of money sitting in that town. And that's where it's going to remain for now. Why haven't they hanged Sean, I wonder? I think he's bait. Well, they want to trial him publicly. Gentlemen, Sean is being moved up the upper Montana, then to a federal prison out west. Damn. Well, we can't be rescuing people from some federal prison. We either rescue him now or cut him loose. We're not cutting anyone loose. Of course not. Ike Skeldings, boys, are moving him to a camp nearby before handing him over to the government. So, I guess... We need to stop them before they get to camp. Charles, why don't you head up on the north side? And then we'll head up on the other side of the valley and meet you. That way we have them in either direction. Javier, Josiah, come on. Let's go see. You know, Arthur, the government, or people whom the government like, seem to be very angry. Sure. Well, we'll rescue Sean and then we'll get ourselves lost good and proper. It's a big country. I hope so. Let's go, girl. Follow me. Let's see if we can track down this boat. Keep your eyes open for Pinkertons. They got patrols out all over this area. Yes, south of the river West Elizabeth isn't a very welcoming place right now. It's definitely as bad as Watch we feared out. in there, Arthur. I keep hearing about this woman, Heidi McCourt. Don't go down there. My lord, the unsubtlety. Yeah. Some young mother, they're saying, Dutch murdered on the boat. I don't know about that. I wasn't there. Bad day. And no money yet, it seems. Ah! I hope you know where that is, at least. Dutch and Hosea say they do, but it's trapped in the town, down there. Reckon those might be our boys. All right, gentlemen. Follow me. Keep your guns away until we know it's Sean, okay? I know what you two are like. You think they can see us? If they can, we're just three fellas out on the trail. Act natural. We'll be fine. So, you've been gone for a while. Much as I love dodging the law and sleeping in the dirt with you derelicts, I do have other business to attend to. What happened in New York? You know how life is. Never a straight road anywhere. Especially with you. Nice to know I missed, though. Have you run out of people to rob? Oh, we'll never run out of people to rob. But without me, you'll not find the caliber of victim that I find. Let's go. Stay with them. You all right, Javier? You're quiet. He hasn't stopped talking since we left you in Valentine. It's the longest ride of my life. Cute, dear boy. Very cute. Push up, come on. Apparently, there's a camp somewhere around here where the bounty hunters meet and transfer before continuing out west. I imagine that's where they're headed. Look, 
They've stopped. Get your binoculars out. Let's see what we're dealing with here. So who are these bounty hunters? I don't know too much about Ike Skelton's boys, but I hear they're a big crew, and wild, built some reputation in the last year or two. That looks like Sean to me. Certainly kicking up enough of a fuss. Yep, that's definitely Sean. Oh, they're giving him a decent kicking. Well, you can only imagine the shit he's been giving them. Oh, yes. They're taking him up the canyon. There's Charles on the other side. Let's go. What about the other two down there? I've got an idea. Follow me. Hey! Then you two sneak across and do the dirty on them. Okay. Crouch down out of sight. Take out your knife. Wait. Okay, let's move down. Don't cross until he's got their attention. Hold up, he's doing his thing. Gentlemen! Gentlemen, excuse me, dear brothers, my wife is taken ill, gravely ill. What's the problem? It's dear Bessie. She's taken a turn. Where is she? A terrible turn. I, I, I'm beside myself. I, if I lose, if I lose Bessie, I lose everything. Oh, calm down, God mister. damn it, Archer. I can't. Okay, let's get after him. We're gonna have to shoot our way up there. A pleasure, as always, gentlemen. I think you have it from here. You're gonna help me out here? Ah! Let's push up!
far. The camp's up this way. Come on. Charles, you take the right. I'll go left. Okay. Take them down! Goddamn army of these bastards. How much is Charles bound? Maybe we should turn them in ourselves. Real time. Less ugly from that other angle, Arthur. Come on. Uh, uh, do I get a hug, Arthur? A warm embrace for a lost brother now found. <laughs> you know, nothing means more to me than this gang. The bond we share. It's the most real thing to me. I would kill for it, I would happily die for it. But in spite of all of that, I would have easily left you here to rot if Charles hadn't stopped me. I don't believe a word of that, Arthur. Get him out of here. You're a great man, Arthur Morgan. The kind of young whippersnapper can really admire. Oh, shut up. Right, we should split up. Javier, will you escort Mr. McGuire back to camp? Charles, best you ride separately. Be careful. There's patrols everywhere. What about you? I'm gonna see what's worth taking here. I'll meet you back there as soon as I can. All right. Okay, come on. <coughs> Have I got stories for you? Yeah, I can't wait. <coughs> I imagine y'all missed me a lot. But fear not, the joy's back in your lives now. Seem in a good mood. I am, son. I am. Let's have some fun tonight. Let's enjoy ourselves. Are we having a party? Maybe. Just a little one. Great. What? Well, Mr. McGuire is back. We're back home now. So come on. So everything's going to be okay. Uncle Sean is back. And don't you worry, Miss Grimshaw, y'all crone. I'll keep them girls in line. If I have to whip them, I will. Did you get a bump on the head? Are you drunk already? <laughs> and don't you worry, Mr. Pearson, you drunk old shitbag. It'll be nothing but the, the finest game in the pot. Now, Dead Eye Maguire's back. <laughs> yeah. And don't worry about nothing, Mrs. Wire. Grimshaw. We'll have this camp running like clockwork. <laughs> I love you, bastards. <laughs> Have fun. Have we lots of fun. Even you, you please. grumpy old bastard, Arthur. Uh-oh, here comes trouble. I just can't get rid of you, can I? Mind if I join you, fine Not folks? I, I suppose. You're looking lovely as ever, if I may say so. Oh, stop it. 
Imagine riding with him all the way from Blackwater to here. So, what now? Come on. How about a song? Them that discovered the stuff must have thought they was gods among monkeys. They discovered fire. I thought you Irish enjoyed a party, Molly. Oh, yeah, I'm enjoying it. Well, I just don't need to fall over drunk with the rest of the <laughs> You know this one, don't you? Go join in. something a little more civil. That's ah, good to be back. I even missed you, <laughs> you old bastard. <laughs> and I missed a good excuse to celebrate. Look at me, with the bell of the ball. Oh, stop it, you. <laughs> I am ready to let loose tonight. Who been too long? You're always ready to let loose, Martian. Well, life's too short. Oh. <laughs> you better go easy, Mark. Family man now. Mr. Morgan. Morgan. Trevor. Hello. Hello. What do you want? I'm not. I'm not quite sure. Oh. This keeps happening. And rover, I roam and sing a merry song. The wide, wide world I wander over with a light, light heart. I rove along. Oh, I'm a wild free rover. I sing a merry song. The wide, wide world I wander over with a light, light heart. I rove along. With a light, light heart. I rove along. The wind roves free o'er hill and river, and the clouds roam free along the sky. Each little bird's a wild free rover, and a rover wild and free am I. Oh, I'm a wild free rover, I can't bear. 